Hi, Javi Dad here, and I'm going to be uh, bringing you a quick video th of uh, the time lapse from throughout the evening here as I introduce a pink eye chalice from Australia into my tank that I just picked up. So I am going to uh, try to see if I can capture the color at all for you here. It's like a two tone mint green with, as you would guess, pink eyes. But I'm gonna unbag it here in just a second, and then I will start the floating procedure. So I have unrubber banded the bag, and at this point I'm gonna put it into acclimate. Acclimation is important for all marine life or even freshwater life. Um, some things are more delicate than others. I am gonna put this in the back of my tank, back here in one of the chambers because if I put it in the main tank, it's gonna be right underneath the LED. And some corals, if you're leaving them acclimate for a long time, you can really blast them with too much light and potentially harm them. Usually not kill them, but maybe set them back. So because this is small enough and I got the room, I'm gonna put it back here. Uh, the longer something was shipped, generally the longer it needs to be acclimated. This had been at a local store for a while. It was only a five minute drive here. So I'm gonna do about an hour hour and 15 minute acclimation. Every 10 minutes or so, I will come in and add about 10% more water to the bag from my tank water so that not only does the temperature start to match up, salinity and other parameters, alkalinity will slowly shift from what the bag currently is to closer to my tank water so it's ready. So I will do that over the course of an hour and then I will come back and unbag it and place it and do just a quick little review of what's in here. Um, right now I have two chalices, a mummy eye chalice that was just a sliver of a frag plug eight months ago. And then this Miami hurricane chalice that uh, two, three weeks ago, I got that and it had raw edges from where it was cut, but you can see now it is healed over very well in the back and is starting to spread and expand at this point. All right, we have our piece of chalice coral. We're going to bring it down here. Cleaner shrimp seems to be very interested in a new piece of coral. You can get in close, you can see it's a, a darker green, even almost purple background, and then with the light green circles and the pink eyes. And then we got the Miami Hurricane Chalice, the red mushrooms which are expanding drastically. We got the four anemones, two of them are still kind of hiding. And the next move here will probably be to take, I got one, two, three big heads of trumpet coral. I'll probably need to move one of those and trade it in to make some room in here. And then the frog spawn, which was very little when I got it, really can't expand any further where it's at. So I'm gonna have to take that out cut it into a couple pieces and move it around. So when I get some more additions or do some more work, I'll put up another video. Thanks for watching.